Hello everybody, you are on a Dreamer Hello channel and today I'm going to show you how to not install Windows 11 on unsupported laptop or PC. Let's imagine that you have already watched my tutorial how to install Windows 11 on unsupported PC. So actually, now you know how to install it, but probably you may forget to select one important option. And now, you can successfully install this operating system. Today, I will show what will happen to your PC or laptop if you do not install Windows 11 correctly. So, let's get started. Today, I will again install Windows 11 on unsupported laptop, Dell E6430, which you could see in my videos before. By the way, do not be surprised when sometimes you cannot install Windows 11 on device that is not supported by this operating system officially. But this does not happen often, and in most cases everything is installed and work without problem. Most importantly, you will not be able to install Windows 11 if you have pirate Windows. Right now, in my hand, I have two laptops, Dell E6430. And actually, I installed Windows 11 on both of them. But when I try to install Windows 11 on the second laptop, I have some issues. And probably I want to tell about it. Consider the first method that is on my channel. Download the ISO file from the official Microsoft website. Then download a special file that allows you to skip the system requirements of Windows 11, including TPM 2.0. You can watch the full video on my channel. When we get to the installation window, I recommend you to choose Keep Personal File Only. It will save your files, folders, photos, archives, etc. But previous program that were installed will probably have to be reinstalled because they may not work after installation Windows 11. But this option I recommend choosing always, and not only when you want to save your files. The fact is that I install Windows 11 several times, completely deleting all the files and all information. I chose this option. And in this case, the system sometimes restarted on this window, and nothing happened. So how you see, this bug did not disappear. Therefore, if it possible, chose Keep Personal File Only. And in the second way, you need to pay attention to the text you are copying, so as not to miss a single letter. Then everything is the same. The only thing to note is that here you have selected the option for all files. And then everything will be fine. In general, I recommend watching all tutorials attentively and do not rewind anything so as not to miss important information. If you have any question, you can write them in the comment. I will try to answer all of them. You can also support the author in PayPal. All link will be in the description. Also, please write what video you would like to see next time. So guys, if this video was useful for you, please like it and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It will help me a lot. Goodbye everyone, we will see you soon.